energy management for athletes can be complicated. Too much or too little glucose can have detrimental effects on your athletic performance, leading up to and during an event. However, glucose levels are complex. More than 40 factors can influence them at any time. Plus, everyone's body has unique fueling requirements, which means you can't just use another athlete's fueling strategy. Training for nutrition or managing fuel levels is nearly impossible without real-time visibility to your own live streaming glucose levels. The human body is constantly producing data. As an athlete, you analyze many of these metrics, heart rate, pace, power, sleep. But the most critical piece to athletic performance is still a black box, glucose, the body's main fuel source. Here's where you can turn the guessing game of fueling and energy management into a personal science. I know, this is complex stuff. So let's look at an example of an athlete training for a marathon. Glucose is regulated around 90 to 100 milligrams per deciliter. For three days leading up to the race, our runner starts glucose loading. You may have heard it called carb loading in the past. For this case, let's say his normal average glucose is 90 milligrams per deciliter. And he has learned over time, he needs to be at 105 milligrams per deciliter of trailing average glucose in order to be properly fueled for a specific event, a marathon. Now, with direct visibility to his glucose levels, it is no longer a guessing game whether he is properly loaded at the starting line. What he eats on the morning of the race is also critical. Let's say he wakes up glucose loaded at 105 milligrams per deciliter of trailing average glucose. Then he eats a super high carb, sugary meal. His glucose will spike, triggering his body's natural response. This response will bring his glucose levels down and potentially even over-regulate the high glucose levels down below the 105 milligrams per deciliter that he started with. But if he knows exactly how his body reacts to what he eats, energy management is no longer a guessing game. He could have eaten a meal that provided a stable and sustainable glucose rise, keeping him in the optimal fueling range. The Super Sapiens Energy Management System is powered by Abbott's LibreSense Glucose Sport Biosensor. Now, for the first time, you can use these technologies to learn your optimal pre-race fuel levels. Our athlete is now ready to compete, showing up to the starting line properly fueled. To sustain the performance he trains so hard for, he must manage energy needs in race to maintain adequate fuel. The consequences of reduced glucose levels are an array of physiological and performance degradations ranging from impaired judgment to loss of power and speed all the way down to running out of energy. Let's say our athlete can sustain peak performance during a marathon between 110 and 120 milligrams per deciliter. This is his optimal performance glucose zone for marathon. With the ability to make real-time adjustments based on live streaming glucose, he can keep his glucose levels within that optimal range at all times, maintain adequate fuel, and sustain his peak performance. That's what gets our friend to the finish line, breaking his personal record. With the Super Sapiens app connected to Abbott LibreSense, you will learn your body's individual response to glucose and exercise. With real-time visibility, you're able to make real-time adjustments. No more guessing, no more missed opportunities. This is the future of sport.